so this is the driveway going in. Do it. And the house is behind all those trees so you can't even see it. And then the barn is right behind those trees. Good morning, guys. Welcome to the best weekend of the entire year. Do you know why it's the best weekend of the entire why? year? Oh. Because it's the, it's the weekend that everybody has to clean the house and everybody has to give me breakfast in bed. I get to sleep in, I get to relax and enjoy my day. And if I get a 5.30 a.m. wake up call like I did today from these hooligans, so what now happens? Now you're all innocent. Yeah, now you're all looking innocent. So what happens is that they climb out and they get stuck here. And then they, don't they just get stuck. They whine. They can't get back out. Here, here's your bed. Get on there. It's time for napping. You've had your breakfast. Oops, sorry. Oh, look at you. Yes. So, get back to cleaning. Oh my gosh, did you guys just see that? That's what they do, and then they scream. That is not cool, dude. Oh my gosh. Obviously your brain is, as, is the same size as your body. Super uh, tiny. Anyway, it's true, the girls are upstairs cleaning. Get upstairs, get cleaning. I'm gonna show them my barn. After, you can show them your barn sure. after. I'm getting, we are getting all of our cleaning done. Hey. Stop it. We are getting all of our cleaning done now, today, so that tomorrow on my day I can rest and relax. But I can't actually rest and relax because we are headed out tomorrow. We're headed out to do something super fun. And um, to, today we are going fishing. I don't know about fishing, but we do have some fun things in plan, in store. We are getting ready to go out. Oh my goodness, Sophia, you crashed me right down to the ground. <laughs> you can't just come and lay on me. Lay on me. Ah, ah. <laughs> Sophia, get off of me. All right, the girls are just playing with all of their stuff. All their stuff. <laughs> Sophia, holy cow. <laughs> Anyway, a horse and gymnastics girl wants to know where you guys got all your like stuff. Where'd you get it? Amazon. Amazon. Yeah. Amazon is your best friend if you're a schlike lover. Amazon is awesome. I had dyed my hair last night and it's looking a little bit rough this morning, but again, I literally put the dye on. I could feel my scalp burning. And then this morning I have big lumps of blisters all over my whole head from dyeing my hair. Puppy! I could just squish this puppy. Mm. I'm not wetting it. Look at you can't hardly see black puppy's faces. Oh, that's because he's not facing. There we go. Look! <laughs> you woke me up at 5.30 this morning, dude. Alright you guys, we have been keeping a secret. And the secret is we are starting to look for a farm. Why do we want to buy a farm? Because we want horses! Yeah. Yeah, so obviously we need a house that we can keep different kind of animals at and rescue animals at. And so we've been looking. We have not had much luck. We're not sure when we're going to find a farm, but we are just looking. So basically we're just doing a drive-by of a farm that's in the right area for us. We need to keep in an area where Sam can still go to work. The barn looks old. Yeah, the barn is old and rickety, so we'll drive by. So anyway... We are. We can only see barns that are close enough, farms that are close enough that Sam can get to work. So we're having problems finding them, finding one. We already went to see one. It was really small and the land was not very cleared. So we decided not to go, you know, not to buy that one. So that's what we're doing. We're just doing a drive by of a farm. We'll show you guys as soon as Sam turns around. The barn looks a little bit rough. So this farm has 100 acres and a stream and lots of trails. And there it is. Yeah, that's the barn right there. Yeah. So 100 acres and there's the barn. Can you vlog it? Yeah. So it looks kind of rough, like it's falling down a bit. Oh, you can hardly see it. So there's actually a barn behind those trees. <laughs> so this is the driveway going in. Do it. And the house is behind all those trees so you can't even see it. 
and then the barn is right behind those trees. There. So that house is $400,000 and the house is kind of questionable. It's kind of sketchy. It's, it's an old, old, old house. We'd have to do a lot of renovations but we'd be getting almost 100 acres, lots of trails, a place to put horses and animals. So anyway, Sam and I are gonna discuss it, see if we wanna go and look at that farm. Do you wanna go look at that farm? Do you think? Of yeah, we might go look at it. But just so you guys know, we are not buying a farm today and we're not buying a farm tomorrow. We are looking around to see what is available and what we could get for our money. And then we're gonna decide when we wanna buy a farm. But we're excited. So we are at our local bridal store, which is our tack shop, and we are looking for breeches. I like those too. They're just like leggings. I know, I but they're one. they're slippery. I feel like Sophia would fly out of the saddle with these. Um, yeah, it's totally here. Oh, yeah. So what did you find? A jumping vest? Yeah. Jumping. Vest. Oh, okay. Two they they're like tight breeches. Right? All right, those are cool. Nice. So that's a jumping vest. That's what people are talking about when they say you should have a back back thing on. I need to try one on. All right. Just to see what one fits So that's what people are talking about, a jumping vest. Just in case I... Whoa, sorry. Let's see, what did you find? It's kind of like the same bridal. Bridal with diamonds on it? Yep. Cool. So we're in the change room this weird little box in the middle of the store. You can see it over the top. Weird, right? It's got like a mirror and a little bench for her to change. All right, you guys, that was a bust because Gabby tried on two pairs of uh, breeches and she loved one, but they were, just wait. See-through. They were see-through. So then she did not like the ones that I picked up for her. Okay, I'm gonna try doing it there, bud. I don't Okay, I like don't know what's happening here, but something is happening. Whoa. Well, that was good. Uh. And we are headed out again. Sophie is trying my smoothie. I made this super yummy smoothie. It's got kale and pineapple and uh, what are those red red things? Pomegranates. Is it good? All right, you guys. We are headed out again. We are headed out fishing because somebody has been driving us crazy, asking us to go fishing. All right, you guys. We are fishing. My hands are full of uh, worm goop because I have to put the worms on. Yep, you have to. Yeah, I have to put the worms on. Hopefully one day you guys will learn how to put the worms on, right? So let's hope we catch up. Oh, I see yours. Oh, yours oh, not even in there yet. That's good, that's good. That's good throw. Okay. Pull it up a bit. Pull, reel it a bit. There you go, leave it, leave it. Leave it now. That's it, you just have to wait now, okay? Sophie, what are you doing? Fishing! That doesn't look like fishing. Okay, turn your reel like this. This fishing rod you have to you have to hold like this. Okay? To hold it like this and you reel it in like that and you that's the button press. So we'll check back with you guys later when we catch something. Just a lazy Saturday afternoon going fishing. Laura is sitting in the car. Too cold for her. It's really not that cold. She's on a hill. See, she's on a hill. So she's, the wind is a little bit more on the hill. Oh, it's gonna be caught one. Did you catch one? Did you catch one or what? No, I didn't. 
Oh. Oh. Okay, toss it back in. Did you catch something? It was on there. Did you catch something? No? No, it is. Seaweed. You got the seaweed monster. <laughs> you got the sea what seaweed monster. At what point are you guys going to learn to take off this stuff yourself? This is not worms, this is seaweed. Oh, he's dead. What did you get, a seaweed monster? No. You get a seaweed monster too? Oh, shoot. Really? And you might have caught a fish. Oh my god, Sophia. Nope. Look at seaweed your rod. Monster. Dad, help me. Help oh, me. No. Did you catch it? What'd you catch? <laughs> well, you, see, you got a one. stuck? A rock monster? <clears throat> Daddy, help. Did you catch a rock monster? Oh. All right, I'll reel it in for you. You catch another one? Seaweed monster? Seaweed monster? <laughs> Probably. No fish is double that strong. Well, that was pretty good there. I don't know what you caught. Let's see. Nothing. Caught nothing. Well, that's it, guys. We oh haven't catch nothing. Oh, God, yeah, we caught something. Well, just as I was saying, we didn't catch nothing. Is you caught something? I think it's uh, I think it's stuck. Got it caught and it got stuck. You guys, my neighbor found a baby bird. Gabby is dying to touch him. Can I? No, you can't touch him because his mama is out there watching for him. Look at, he's sleeping. He's totally content there. Look at, look at his breasts. Can you see them? No, oh, he doesn't look stressed out, that's for sure. All right, here's Connor and Gabby swinging from a tree. Uh-oh, isn't there a poem? <laughs> isn't there a poem about that, something like that? Connor and Gabby swinging from a tree. K I S S I N G. They're like, what? Let Gabby swing. Jump. One, two. Ah, good jump. I couldn't do it. My arms are not that strong anymore. So um, there's Gabby swinging from the tree. Hi guys, I'm Hockey Boy, um, and I'm Gabby's friend. <laughs> and we're gonna do a collab soon, and subscribe to my channel. It's Hockey Boy, spell Hawk, and then add Y to the end, and then <laughs> yeah. Hello, hello, hello! Ah! <laughs> yeah, that's legs. Oh, what are these guys doing? Are you gonna play basketball, baseball? You playing baseball? Yeah. Hello, These puppies. Guys love. Oh, when it's pooping, go over there so you don't lose where it's pooping. Oh, Hello, look at these guys. The oh my goodness. The girls put the puppies in that basket to bring them out here. I love watching them run after the girls. Get out! <laughs> what are you doing? You This boy is so cute. So cute, one smell on my butt. Get out of my butt. That's Molly. <laughs> Molly, get out of my butt. Oh, if you sit down there, <laughs> they you eat your hair. <laughs> oh they my gosh. They literally eat your hair. Well, you should be used to them eating your hair now that you had the goat. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, Holly, smell this puppy poop out here. Whoa, whoa, you are cute. Molly. Ow. Molly, oh. Molly. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, that is what you call a, a, woo, a fighting bundle of fur. Come here. Molly. Uh oh, that one's licking the other one's butt. Get it out. Ow, ow, maybe they do eat their poop, own poop. Okay. Hey, Chloe. <laughs> get away. Chloe. Gotta wear shoes out here. Look at how cute. Chloe. That's Chloe. And do not wear flip flops out here with puppies. Not gonna lie, when they go home tomorrow, happiest girl ever. And then, and then mom. <sighs> You put your flip-flops down and the next thing you know. You put your flip-flops down and then the next thing you know, they're ruined. Look at, they're biting a tiger. Puppy's eating a tiger. <laughs> Whoa, that flip-flop is as big as her. <laughs> Whoa, and they're gonna fight over it. This guy, so big, so cute. Look, at he's licking my ear. Ow, I guess he's chocolate chip now. His name is chocolate chip. Say hi chocolate chip. Oh, did you guys say see he waved it? He waved at you all on his own. This girl Molly oh, is half the size. Well, she's skinny. Oh my gosh. There's a fight. There's a war over Gabby's flip-flop. 
Underneath that big pile of puppies is our Gabby is Gabby's flip flop, and this one just keeps coming back to bite my toes. Go away! Hi guys, her name's Trouble. No, Slash her no. name's her name's Zoe, but her name name is Trouble. Trouble she Zoe. Always starts the fight. Whoa! Now I got two puppies. That's legs. Anyway, you guys. Whoa! Luna. Whoa! Uh, Molly, Trouble Luna. and I are gonna end today's vlog Molly. because I have a lot of editing Molly, to do Luna. tonight. So we're gonna see you guys tomorrow. And happy Mother's Day to all the amazing mothers out there. Ouch. I hope it's the best Mother's Day ever for all of you. I hope you all get to sleep in and I hope, I'm like getting a huge ear massage here. I hope you all get to sleep in. I hope you all get breakfast in bed. I hope your husbands clean the whole house for you. And yeah, I hope that for all of you mothers out there. See you tomorrow. Bye. Say bye. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.